Hello everyone, welcome to the nation, and today we are going to a thing called the Ark Encounter. It's going to be pretty cool. It's supposed to be based off like Noah's Ark from the Bible, whatever, and it's supposed to be really massive. Actually, I'm standing in front of it, I'll record it here. There's the Ark. It's a... Uh, it's like seven stories high, 500 and some feet long. It's actually really massive. And um, we're gonna be going on that. I'll probably like video some stuff. I think there's like an animal thing where it has a bunch of like different types of animals, not sure. And then they have a zip line thing. And I don't know, I didn't bring my action camera, so I don't know how that'll go down for me recording it, but uh, we'll see. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this. Here we are getting closer now and this thing really is huge like here's some people next to it Like this thing is massive And uh, we're gonna go be we're gonna be going inside it It's like I believe like the biggest structure ever made out of like completely wood and it's really cool so Yeah, let's let's go inside Here we are like up under the bottom of it and as you can see, well, I can't really see through the camera, but it's really huge, and we can go under it really far and all that. And uh, yeah, we're getting working our way inside. Now we're under it. We're going inside it, and uh, we're going to go inside of that. And there's like a time lapse video of how long it took it to make it. it took them like over a year to make it. So that's that's crazy. And that was a lot of noise, and I don't... ...speakers, so there's not anything to worry about. I was gonna... I was gonna play some Pokemon Go here, but this is in the middle of nowhere, so... There's nothing here. So... Yeah. We got a green screen. Looks like we're gonna get our pictures in front of some cool background. Yeet. I believe this is how he did it. He had to, like, swell up the wood and whatever to make it form together. And if you hear that, that's like uh, like a thunderstorm coming out of the speakers, so pretty loud. There's no end of people right there, I guess. some weird animals you've probably never seen before. They're not real animals, obviously. They're just statues. But apparently they're on the ark. That's pretty cool. There's nothing in these two, but I don't know. Here they cut it in half and like showed like all the compartments all the way along. It's pretty cool. Yep, there it is, cut all the way down it, halfway. Actually, on the other side, it shows the boat itself. All right, guys, so I'm sitting on the second level. I'm kind of close to the front here, you can see. It's actually the front of the boat right there. Um, second level. Um, largely, this is just a bunch of uh, cool pictures, like, not pictures, but like structures of animals that uh, really don't exist anymore because, are, are extinct because they have a, uh, like, zoo type thing where they have a lot of other animals on there who are obviously still um, in existence, you know, like elephants, stuff like giraffes, stuff like that, normal things you see at a zoo. And they have some interesting things that are still alive. Um, but here in the Ark, it's mainly just uh, statues of animals that have gone extinct since. And uh, there are a few exhibits, but they're just kind of pictures on the wall and a lot of reading. So I'm going to try to get a little bit of like maybe time lapse or just walking through. Um, the arc and then I'll um, come back once we're on top or whatever where you can see out over this is in Kentucky where you can see like over all the trees and stuff and then the zip lining so this is spooky encounter so we'll see see what it is we're just gonna walk through real quick Yeah, we 
Guys, here's an exhibit about like the living quarters and stuff, and here's a bunch of their supplies and all their food. Imagine like just they'd have to have a ton of food in theory to make it that long. So especially with like all the animals that were said to be on there. So like, all this stuff, they had to have stuff to grow it like this, and uh, yeah, it's pretty interesting. Well, guys, uh, they don't have the top part where you can like look out that I thought they did. Um, but I can like show you up the windows real quick. They do have windows opening to see out, but um, I believe this is as high as you can go is where we are. You can see down there, all the way down. But uh, I thought they were going to have like a deck where you could go out on, but apparently they don't, so that's a bummer, but I'm probably going to go out of here, eat, and then like do some zip lining and other stuff that they have here. Yeet. Alright guys, here's the end of the arc. We are now outside. I think we're going to go eat right now in this building right behind me over here. And then I believe there's some animals to look at and then we'll go zip lining and it should be fun. Guys, I found the Mega Kangaskhan. There's four of them. Just kidding. Obviously these are kangaroos, but... Yeah, see? They're all hot, so like all laying down taking naps. Can't really see what's going on the phone, but yeah. I'm gonna ride some cam camels with my brother. See, camel right here. Yeet. got off the camel there hope you guys enjoyed that that was pretty fun um, now we're looking at more uh, animals to look at and then we got some like goods to pet and we got some zebras back there and badass zebras yeah awesome the cool part is like not a single one of the zebras has the same like stripe pattern all right guys now we got some got some toros got some toros in here so we got Two out of three regional Pokemon here. No, I'm just kidding. We got some yaks up in here. Which not really is what a Tauros is. A Tauros is a bull. Uh, bison, but here we are. We got some yaks. Here we got an emu right here. He looks pretty tired right now, but it's pretty cool. We got another one standing up over here. Here's the emu that's standing up. Yep, there's the one that's standing up. There's a few others, but they're not over here. We got some goats to pet over here. Ah. This, this one's eat? named Malchus. He's pretty cute. He's got tiny ears. Not only meat, so shoes. They will eat your clothes. Your mom, mom had her shirt dress. Go ahead. Here's a guy over here. He's got some. He's got some little antlers. Hey, buddy. Hey buddy. Oh yeah, he's eating right now. Oh. They walked away. This guy is my friend right here. He just he just wants to be pet by somebody. This Malchus is wide, look at that. Looks like he's got a baby in there. Oh did you hear that These guys are real cute. He's growing his antlers right here. Marcus is very serious. He's nosy and he's... Found a real small one who wants to be my friend. He's cute. 
the sheep's only a month old. Oh, wow, really? He's really nice. You just sometimes can't see if you're food or not. <laughs> So we came back and on our way out and the kangaroo was posing like he's on a magazine cover or something. Pretty funny. Alright guys, so we're uh, headed back. We're going to leave. It was pretty exciting. Unfortunately, the uh, zip line was shut down. So we weren't able to do that. And... Um, but it was fun. I like the uh, petting zoo and uh, the ark. It was fun and everything. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like. Slap that subscribe button. Join the nation if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one.